Hi guys, this is Tanya Meadows with Apple Tree Homeschool Academy. And today I have a shopping haul from a church sponsored yard sale that I went to this morning. And the situation is, is I run a home daycare. And in the fall, one of our families will be having another child. And so I will be uh, responsible for a newborn. And um, I was able to find some good bargains today, two different um, yard sales actually. And this is um, a little bassinet style rocker and here, this is all the pieces to it that I got for $10 at the second yard sale and it happens to be from a family of a neighbor of ours so we have a small town we live in a small town and that's one nice thing about small town is everybody knows somebody who knows somebody now underneath of this uh, I got a new uh, little mat changing diaper changing pad that I needed to uh, replace the current one that I have so um, at our second yard sale that I hit w I found all of these newborn uh, clothing for one of my family members that's having a, um, a a baby it'll be one of my new grandchildren little grandson coming so I picked those up for my um, son and daughter-in-law I picked up all of these little sets of blocks for a dollar a piece. I got these two Eric Carl books for 25 cents a piece. All of these books that you see here were 25 cents a piece. We have a lot of first readers and uh, this little lion and the food truck for the train table, the dinosaur, the little zebra. All of those were 25 cents a piece. I got this little rosemary uh, slate painting to put on my rosemary bush for 50 cents. I got this hook for 25 cents. I got uh, this Mightier Than the Sword book, I believe, for 25 cents. It might have been with a little boy. At the church uh, yard sale, there was a little boy that had his own little um, table there. And so I did pay a little bit more for the Star Wars storybook but I did find these homeschooling supplies and I found uh, history studies time travelers colonial life for 25 cents behind enemy lines 25 cents the story of the world and this is volume 2 for 25 cents this I got off the little boys card and now this is not Benjamin Franklin like we thought this is um, give me liberty or give me death. Okay, I got this brand new historical document posters, which includes the Declaration of Independence and what is that the Bill of Rights. I got that for I think that was twenty five cents as well. This atlas for twenty five cents. Let me see if I can sort through some of these books real quick. The Velveteen Rabbit. Uh, Little Jack Rabbit, Penguins, a St. Patrick's Board Book for 25 cents. Every one of these were 25 cents. A uh, Bible Board Book, 25 cents. Um, a Dr. Seuss Book, 25 cents. First Reader's uh, Bats. My grandson will probably like that. Okay. All of these books I got for 25 cents. And now I have themed bins for that I operate my home day care um, through themes and I will put some of these themed books in my themed bins and that's how I store some of these Let's see if I can get some more here here's another board book 25 cents biscuit book first reader I can read 25 cents dolphins parrots the alphabet tree all 25 cents Okay, and these were great steals for for uh, these hard covered books. So let me move these out of the way real quick. I got this good sturdy basket here for the daycare for a dollar. I got this little um, this little uh, fella here. I think these are are these Fisher Price. Let me see real quick. Pretty sure that's Fisher Price. Look real quick. Can't really remember. Yeah. 
Fisher Price. Let's get that focused in Fisher Price. And I've got the female uh, little girl doll, dog of this version. So I was telling the people at the table at the church sale that I was looking for good sturdy baskets. And this is the only one that I had on their uh, table. But when I came out and was doing some other shopping through the actual church, inside church building, when I came out, they actually gave me these two baskets uh, for free because they knew I was looking for it for a home daycare. So I'm trying to incorporate the baskets as part of um, incorporating some of the Waldorf teaching style into our classroom. And I got this uh, little stacking toy for a dollar. And I'm going to pause you real quick and show you some other goodies. At the second yard sale that's um, a family related to my neighbor, I found this almost brand new um, pack and play, which I've been needing to swap out our pack and plays that we current that I had first bought when I started the daycare because now it's time to replace those. And this uh, is in great shape. Got this for $25. I got this bassinet that's in great shape from the same family for $20. A great shape. Then last but not least, I found this great deal at the churchyard sale for $25. No, excuse me, for $15, and I actually gave them $20. They were asking $15 for this beautiful rocking chair. And it came with the cushions. This is what the bottom look. It's really good and sturdy. And let me put this back on here, and I'll show you what it looks like in the back. And then this is what it looks like in the back. So I really found some great deals today for the daycare and for a little bit for our homeschool supplies and so don't be afraid to shop thrift stores yard sales uh, ask family and friends when they're going to be having yard sales or look look at facebook marketplace for great deals if you like this video go ahead and click the subscribe button and the like button leave us a comment below and i like to encourage you to be thrifty with your budget. So look at all of the stuff that we got for hardly anything. Um, let me say, all of these clothes I got, newborn clothes, was $10 for all of that. $0.25 cents for the books. Free, two free baskets. A dollar for this book. A dollar for that. A dollar for that. $10 for that. $4 for that. Um, 15 is what they asked. I paid 20 uh, 25 for that, and I think I paid $20 for that. So, I hope you like this video, and click subscribe. Happy homeschooling. Happy home daycare. Thanks. Bye.